Welcome to this video demonstrating the modeling capabilities of Open Buildings Energy Simulator. Multiple file formats are supported by the software, allowing you to leverage existing building model data. For example, HivaComp Design Database projects can be imported directly, along with GBXML and Google SketchUp models. BIM models can also be directly imported with the analytical space model function available in Open Buildings Designer. The standard workflow for building up a model manually is to add your 2D floor plans and then to use this to trace your 3D rooms. Again, multiple file formats are supported for this, so you can use DWG, DGN, DXF files, for example. Here we will add a floor plan, which has been saved as a DXF file. We can start building up our rooms by selecting the trace option. This will open up a menu, allowing us to specify the room type, room name, and room dimensions. Alternatively, these settings can be set as defaults prior to drawing under the Data Managers tab under Defaults. We can begin tracing room 1.16 and specify this as rectangular. Doing so will allow us to simply enter the room with only two mouse clicks. You can use the mouse wheel to easily zoom in or out to focus on the room in question and then just left click on the opposite corners of the room to complete. An exciting feature in the software is the ability to utilize all the different view windows to manipulate your model. To show this, we will trace the adjacent room 1.17. As before, we entered the room name and associated dimensions. For this room, we will deselect the rectangular option. To show this, if we move the mouse focus up to view 2, we can begin tracing our room there in 3D. Using the mouse wheel to zoom in and pan, we can left click to begin tracing the corners of the room. As our view of the next point is obscured by the adjacent room, we can continue tracing in view 1. Simply move the mouse focus to view 1 and then left click on the remaining corners to complete. When the second room is completed, the software will automatically update the room surfaces to include the dividing partition. 